presidential candidate of the All Progressives Congress, APC Bolatin, who has dismissed the People's Democratic Party, PDP, and Labour Party as mushroom parties. Wow, we've started mentioning the Labour Party. Wow, that is a, a strong thought force at that. Pledging on Tuesday to ensure that both parties will labor to death. Mr. Tinubu, while campaigning for incumbent governor, Gwigawitola, APC candidates in the upcoming July 16th Oshun governorship election, pleaded with the electorate to please do the same thing you did in the kitty. Come out with your PVCs and votes massively for APC. Mr. Tinubu told APC supporters to think about your children and vote accordingly so you can see the future <laughs> in fact uh, these are just uh, open the seats irrespective of whether we we'll let them win or let them not win that is their own cup of tea uh somebody was coming saying asking a question bringing the picture or the video of a uh, those who showcase the five thousand that they collect from apc they said they collect the money from apc and they uh, are being asked now whether they are still spending that 5,000 Naira. So with all these things happening now, with the same thing Tinumbu told them in 2014-2015, now the future is here. As at that 2014 and 2015, if you compare it to now, so what is the assurance of their next future in the next seven or five or four years as the case may be? At least they should be able to tell us now their future now since uh, 2014 mm. don't mind pdp and other mushroom parties parties like labor they will labor till they die god will not make you make you laborers where scheduled for this weekend a ocean election as last yusuf as the lp candidates he will slug it out at the polls with mr yetola and ademola adeliki of pdp on monday mr b the Labour Party presidential candidates had called on his supporters to donate in support of Mr. Larson, saying that the Labour Party plans on using the Oshun governorship election to begin the process of taking back Nigeria. He explained that the donated funds will be used to cover expenses for appalling unit agents and logistics on election day. Mm. <laughs> to be honest, see, eh? if, if, if somebody is deceiving you, I think you should not be able to deceive yourself. Somebody can try to deceive you, but you know within yourself, you should not be deceived. Tinubu said, look at your future. Don't mind all those uh, mushroom parties. It is your children and your future. Who has been in the who has been the governor of that state? Or who, which party has been in has been the ruling party of that state? It's not the same APC. They have been there. So the people should be able to tell you whether they are if they are okay with it. There's no problem. I don't even I don't see I see no reason why anybody should beg anybody. Hey, please so no now. People who are voting they are adults, they know what to do, they know what is okay for them. The ones that collected five thousand era in a equity state, I think they are still happy with it. If that is what they want. If somebody is saying I'm not suffering or the kind of suffering I'm going through, I don't say it's not a big deal. So why should you be crying more than the bereaved? If the people want it, good and fine. Let them go ahead and do it. No problem. Mm -hmm. Tinubu is a very good man. He's a great listener. He has a very humble and friendly disposition to everyone. He's very generous in both cash and kind, especially where it could advance his political interest. But I have realized that it is like the power that psychophants and lab dogs have the most influence on leaders with such character traits they will lie to him malign and disparage others and generally do anything to curry his favor and also put well-meaning associates in bad light i suspect this is what uh, has happened to my friend he has been cornered by self-serving hero worshipping lab dogs how can you be productive without labor APC have started deceiving the people again. Let them be deceived now. Are they not okay? Are they foolish? Mm -hmm. are they, are, are, you don't need to beg anybody. That is it. You don't need to persuade everybody or anybody. As many who are of voting age, you don't need anybody to start telling you. You should be able to tell and be able to. You have the experience. You should be able to say what is this is what you want. Or this is not a what you want. 
Tinubu has also decided to end his life very badly. I never fancied making money in an evil way because such persons don't always end well. Tinubu old age is affecting him. Vote for APC on your own risk. Habiala, try Muslim Muslim ticket. Failed. Tinubu too will fail. God bless all obedient groups. Error 101. Both the APC Muslim Muslim ticket, presidential ticket, and PDP zoning of the presidency to the north are all error 101. Labour Party is an orphanage home for old, greedy, power mongers, retired politicians. Our mentor Ashwaji Bola Tinubu will be going to retire them politically before the upcoming election by God's grace. Good. Congratulations. Mm. Who is old in the old party, in the Labour Party? Can you hear yourself? Labour Party is for old and power monger. You make me laugh. Who is old? Tinubu or Obi? You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You are part of Nigeria's problem. I think the person doesn't even understand what he wrote himself. God will shame you all. But big enough to bother you and for you to talk about it. It is a thing of concern. Thank you for the cheap publicity. Kindly change your leader or try and take something more lesser. Because whatsoever you are taking is not your working well in system hmm. where an old man that talks like a kid between tinubu and obi and wondering who is really laboring to death a man who by now supposed to be playing and retirement say uh, in retirement with his uh, grandchildren is laboring to die because of greed can you imagine <laughs> look at what the presidential experience is bringing out from his mouth ah too bad says someone that cannot walk for 10 minutes without falling we the obedience don't have money but we have we are laboring in the name that is above other name hmm. all our labor shall not be in vain there's dignity in labor and shame in stealing we proudly work for our earnings but you steal from the people your days of looting are now numbered your evil plans of turning Nigeria into your empire, we fail. Labour Party, we outlive him. Doesn't he look like a vegetable already? Beyond possible Nigeria president talking like thug that he clearly is. Sinubu, you will not die but live to see the victory of Peter Obi. Now the shock from the victory will last last send you, send you antenna to eternal coma. You call this Democrats? <laughs> Why the insults and bad wishes? You see now, now they start them, but they will not see, see that is insulting people. But if they start to give and now, they will come, they shout. The people that are always coming, going out to counter other people's protests, what do you call them? No, they don't say anything good about it or bad about it. Let us watch and see. Now, money cannot intimidate voters again because we all fund the campaign. Okay, Tinubu, your death is at hand, as you have mentioned that. Oh my goodness. Hmm. This man is too dumb. How can he relate with foreign investors? Okay. If he wins, the wise man will be thinking all Nigeria are as dull as him. What a pity. Okay. Okay. Somebody talking about his movement or association with uh, the whites. There's dignity in labor and not in scamming innocent citizens of their wealth. Once an Agberu, always an Agberu. You truly believe you know when life and death comes you lie apc as a party ought not to be existing in this country let alone still having a candidate 